Hey everybody, it's uh, Sam Shackleton here. Um, I am currently in Edinburgh Waverley Station, um, waiting to leave to London to uh, start my Netherlands tour uh, with S. Louis, and I'm really excited. Uh, I'm going to take you along the way. Uh, I need a bit of a shave, and uh, I'm a little bit tired, but uh, I'm ready to go, and uh, I really want to take you along with me and uh, just show you a little bit about what it's like for a banjo busker going on uh, his first European tour. So, yeah, hope you enjoy. I'm leaving on a rattling train Can't seem to stay here long So I've just arrived in London and uh, there's this band over here playing some music so I'm gonna let you see it London until you see London Underground. <laughs> so I uh, finally arrived in London and uh, I am just right outside uh, St Pancras station now about to board a train to uh, Paris. Uh, I'm gonna stay there for one night and then I'm gonna go to the Netherlands and do my first gig at the Museum of Humanity. I'm gonna get in there uh, before I miss my train uh, because London is drawing me in. I wish I'd spent a bit longer here, maybe on the way back. So we're finally here in Paris, the beautiful city of Paris, Paris Nord station. It was a very pleasant journey and we're literally about to go outside right now for the first time in Paris. Of this journey, oh my God, what a beautiful place. Here we are, Paris. It's great to be here in this beautiful city. Unfortunately, I'm only here for the night though, so uh, yeah, gonna have to make the most of it. Well, it turns out that the hostel I booked in Paris wasn't very nice after all. Uh, there was a lot of crazy people up in my room and uh, a lot of madness going on around the hostel in general. So I decided that because I wasn't gonna get much sleep there anyway, to go down to this little uh, French 24 hour cafe and sit uh, for most of the night, uh, people watching and drinking uh, this lovely French coffee and eating some uh, fresh croissants as well. It was a very pleasant evening. But yeah, uh, if you're staying in Paris, uh, I'd say be careful with some of the hostels that you book because this one uh, really wasn't somewhere that you'd want to spend the night. It's part of my uh, mental uh, French adventure. I am now on uh, some kind of metro, double-decker metro train. just got off uh, this sort of metro double-decker cool looking train uh, at Paris Gare de Lyon station. Uh, it's uh, very early and uh, to be honest I didn't have the best of sleeps. Uh, I didn't even sleep at all in fact. I booked a hostel and to be honest I probably should have just stayed at that 24-hour cafe because it was pretty cool and I had a big head security guard as well so I felt pretty safe. Uh, <laughs> um, and I also had some nice croissants there, so I think I had a pretty French experience for the uh, short time I'm here. I'm really impressed with these cool double-decker metro trains, though. Uh, I have no idea where I'm going now. Uh, I'm heading to Paris 
uh, bus station. I think someone's shouting at me as well, so perhaps it's time to put away the phone. So as you can see, I have finally made it to Amsterdam. I have freshened up a little bit and uh, I've got my banjo on my back and I'm ready to go for my first gig with S. Louis, uh, S. Lois. And uh, it's gonna be a great time at the Museum of Humanity. I'm just heading there now. I'm gonna get a wee bite to eat and uh, maybe a wee something else before I go. Uh, a nice big coffee because I haven't slept in two days. I didn't sleep at all last night on the bus, but being in Amsterdam, this place has given me a lot of energy, so I'm uh, really buzzing about it. So yeah, I, I'm gonna take you there and hope you enjoy. Cheers. I'm currently uh, sitting eating a McDonald's in Amsterdam and it is the most beautiful view I think I've ever eaten a McDonald's to <laughs> in all my life. Uh, it's really lovely. Um, I'm just about to go to Central Station back there and get a train to Zan Dam, where I'm gonna do the damn thing. That was shite, but uh, yeah, I'm gonna do a class gig there with S. Louie, S. Lois, and uh, yeah, it's gonna be fucking class. So uh, I hope you enjoy as much as I'm enjoying this burger. Cheers. Everybody, we fucking made it. It was a long journey here, but we did it. Check this cool Dutch train out as well. There's one moving. That's the one I was just on. Uh, very short journey got my Starbucks for energy because I haven't slept in like two days um, and yeah so I'll let you know how it goes. Beautiful Museum of Humanity as you can see uh, just about to go and watch S. Lois opening up for me uh, so I uh, this is gonna be class. <laughs> So uh, after a very successful and enjoyable night playing in Zandam with S. Lois and uh, met a bunch of really amazing people. So if uh, you're one of them, uh, thank you so much for coming. Uh, some people traveled miles to be there and uh, I was really flattered. Just uh, just really fucking amazing. Uh, I'm really humbled at how amazing that was, how amazing that was and uh, all the support as well. And uh, I'm ending the night by uh, walking through the centre of Amsterdam with a uh, big thing of mental mayonnaise chips that the Dutch seem to be very fond of. And I tell you what, as a Scottish person who uh, appreciates mayonnaise uh, to a great extent because of our lack of taste buds, I very much love this. This is the best way to end the night. Um, so yeah, thank you so much to everyone that came. Uh, that's the first gig done. Now I've got a few days to take it easy, rest and we get at it again, right back at it, with some more gigs in some other different parts of the Netherlands. So yeah, love you all. Thank you so much for coming. Great night. I'm gonna enjoy my chips now. That's gonna be the end of this video. Love you all.
free and true.